Hey guys, hope you guys are doing well. Today I'm going to make a video about a very important thing, which is uh, how to transfer your data from an iPhone to an iPhone. And uh, before I start my video, as I always request you guys to subscribe my channel. That will be a great help to me. And uh, don't forget to ring the bell icon so you get the notification whenever I upload the video. So there was a big update uh, on iPhone iOS 15. Like you can transfer your data from iPhone to iPhone by using the transfer function. So here is uh, one of my iPhone 12 Pro and uh, another one is iPhone XS. I'm using a case on it. So to transfer your data first of all you need to make sure about the things which is the most important so you won't it won't take that long mine will take long longer than usual because i have a lot of stuff so the thing you need to make sure before you start transferring your data that uh, your ios variants both should be same like uh, you can update both of them to the latest ios that would be good before you start transferring your data i'm doing this first time might will have some problems while doing it so let's start and uh, all you need to go into the settings first of all then uh, go into the general after general you need to click on the transfer button transfer or reset your iphone obviously i'm not going to reset it but you need to click over here here it says that prepare for a new iphone make sure you everything's ready to transfer to a new iphone even if you don't currently have enough icloud storage to back up okay so i'll click get started you will be ready for your new iphone all right that's it click done So click start, get started. Okay, so it's saying that I have to reset this iPhone before I continue. So what I'm going to do is going to reset this iPhone, going into the settings, general, all the way down, transfer and reset here i'm going to do reset all content and settings continue continue i did not have anything to the in the new iphone so i just set it out i didn't know that uh, i have to like uh, reset it before i transfer the data so that's another thing you have to do before you start transferring the data so in this case what will happen actually when you're going to try uh, transfer your data you have to keep the new phone near to your older phone so you will receive a pop-up on your iphone xs or your old iphone i would say so as you can see it's a reset and that's turning on now So it's, as you can see, it's totally reset now. When I go over here, I will receive the pop-up over here to set up a new iPhone. Yes, click continue. And now it's gonna show me the code to scan in my old iPhone, which I'm gonna do it right now, like this. I just scanned that code in my iPhone, the older one. It's asking me for the passcode on the other phone. This, setting up your iPhone, so that's 
the only thing you need to be and there's one more thing i would like to tell you at this point while you are transferring this way you have to have a passcode on the old iphone otherwise this process will not work so make sure you have a passcode on your old iphone so that's the only way you can make this process work so uh, now it's setting, setting up my icloud account to activate this iphone So it might will take some time to activate it may take a few minutes to activate your iphone once it will be done it will ask you to set a few things like uh, your face id your passcode your uh, like few more step like analytics or like you see that it's asking me to set up a face id which i will do later so i will touch on uh, setup later So it's transfer data from iPhone XS, that's it. Continue, setting up your Apple ID. If your both phones are not on the same iOS, so while, doing, uh, while transferring your data, it's start gonna update your phone. And trust me, that take too much time so don't forget to update both of the phones to the latest ios so it will help you get your transfer done faster than uh... so i got a notification that my account is signed in to the new account so i only need to hit continue Okay, so I will do that later, so that's not a problem. Not now. Set up later in settings. Preparing to transfer. So let's start transferring the data. So once it will be done, you will see that it's gonna even copy everything. Even the wallpaper of my iPhone XS is gonna be on the new iPhone 12 Pro. So at this point, I would say that it's gonna take time. So I would let it uh, get done. And uh, it says like 13, 13 minutes, 15 minutes. I know that because it's uh, too much data on my phone so uh, I know it's gonna take time so I will be right back after it's, it's gonna be about to get done all right So as you can see that the uh, transfer is complete on my iPhone XS. Now it's gonna reboot my new iPhone. And uh, once the reboot will be done, all of my application and everything is gonna be on the new iPhone. So that's all the procedure about, I was talking about iOS 15, that's pretty good. And uh, you don't need to do anything, but it, uh, as uh, the time depends on the data you have in your phone so that's uh, that's the that's it uh, for the transfer there's nothing else you need to do no like cable to cable or nothing like that
So all you need to do is like, uh, you need to make sure about two things. The first thing is that both of the iPhones should be on uh, the latest iOS or the same iOS. The other thing you need to make sure the new iPhone should be all reset and on the hello screen. So in that case, you will get the pop up on the old phone to transfer your data. So right now, as you can see that everything uh, is transfer has been complete. It's asking me to erase this iPhone now, which I do not want to at all. So not now. I am back on my home screen and uh, just waiting for the new phone to boot up and once it will boot up and uh, everything will be good to go. So like I'm done with my old phone now, Thus, let's just put it on the side. So here's my new phone. So it's back on hello screen as I told you that it's even gonna copy your wallpaper from the iPhone XS. So same passcode as on the other one continue agree it's gonna be again same setup you need to do a little bit I don't want to do anything right now so just set up later so what's the difference no one can say that <laughs> is it the same is a different iPhone so it's loading all the applications so as you can see first page second third fourth fifth seven, six seven eight and everything is same so that's all you need to do when you want to transfer your data from iPhone to iPhone and uh, that's it for the day so before I leave uh, go ahead and subscribe my channel don't forget to ring the bell icon so you would know that whenever I'm uploading the new video. Thank you. Thank you for watching.